guys, welcome to Wrestling Days and welcome to an excited Wrestling Days because we are going to have a look at my top 5 weirdest WWE items that you can get this holiday season. All of these are available to buy at the moment uh, and let me be crystal clear. I think a lot of these are incredible. I think they're awesome. I pretty much want them all. I am not saying that they're not cool or they're not, you know, desirable. I'm just saying they're a little bit weird. Uh, and let's start off, shall we, with standees. There seems to be loads of these at the moment. Uh, loads of WWE superstar standees. Uh, you can get, like, Ronda Rousey. You can get The Miz. You can get Kurt Angle. You can get Elias, which doesn't make any sense because people want to walk with Elias, not stand next to a cardboard cutout of Elias. Um, but still pretty cool. But I just don't get where would it go in your room? Have you got space for this? Do most people have space for this? Um, I mean, I've, I've got one. I've got Hulk Hogan one. Uh, that is to actually advertise Legends of WrestleMania, uh, a game that came out a few years ago. Uh, I absolutely love it. I think it's awesome. It's like hulking up. Uh, so I've got space for it. But I honestly don't know where I would put, like, another one. Uh, and I have seen some that look amazing. Check out this Asuka one. This Asuka one with the robe. So brightly coloured. It looks awesome. So really, really tempted by that. But again, I, I don't know where I would put it. And I don't know where the average home would... Ha You're not going to put this in your living room, are you? Are you? I, I don't know. Uh, so yeah, it's just a little bit... It's a little bit weird. Next up, we've got waste packs, uh, which sounds very weird. I don't mean waste as in things you throw away. Uh, I mean waste as in your waste uh, around the middle of your body. Uh, these, I think, are better known as fanny packs in America and bum bags here in the UK. Uh, but uh, WWE have probably gone with the better name of waste packs. Uh, so these waste packs are basically, uh, it's a bag, it's uh, something that you can put loose change in, you can put bits and bobs in so you don't have to fill your pockets or you don't have to carry a, a bag, uh, which makes perfect sense. The fact that they've put championship design across the front, uh, a belt, uh, looks awesome. But again, it's just a little bit weird, I don't feel like I could go out wearing this uh, without people making some comments. I feel like this might be more for youngsters out there, um, but I, I, it makes sense. I do understand it's, it's a bag around your waist, so why wouldn't you put a title design on it? Not sure if they're going to make more of these. Uh, I, honestly, I don't know. I do think they're a bit weird. They are also a little bit cool. Uh, they're on WWE Shop right now for around about £17 uh, and probably about $20. Next up, we've got something that makes very little sense. This is Lumpy. Lumpy, the plush koala toy. Uh, this was made for Super Showdown. Uh, so this is Lumpy the Koala, uh, and it's WWE Live. You can see that he's got, like, uh, gritted teeth. He's got a wrestling mask on. He's got WWE Live. I don't know why it doesn't say Super Showdown. Maybe it's because they want to sell it after Super Showdown has finished. Uh, so that's why it's probably a little bit more generic. Um, but, yeah, this was made only because... WWE did that show in Australia, so they were like, we need something for the Australian market. I know, a koala! <laughs> so, yeah, that is it. I, to my knowledge, this has never been seen on TV. There is no Lumpy the Koala character. There's no comic book. There's no... There's nothing. This thing just appeared out of nowhere. So, if you would like a Lumpy... The koala. Why is he called Lumpy as well? That li it makes no sense. Does he get beat up often? I don't know. Uh, again, you can get this uh, on WWE Shop for £16.77 or around $20. 
Number two on the list, and this item comes courtesy of Uncanny Brands. Uh, they are selling this in about a week's time at the end of October, and it is this WWE toaster. Uh, it's going to cost $34.99. It's got the WWE Championship on the side. It looks like a normal black toaster otherwise. No idea if it burns that logo into the bread. I don't know that. I, I hope it doesn't because I wouldn't want to buy this and have part of the bread always burnt. Even if it is the WWE logo, like, I should imagine at first it's cool, but fast forward a month, I think it's going to get annoying. Uh, if you just want some nice uh, toast, like golden brown, I don't want parts of it getting burnt. Uh, so, I hope it doesn't do that, but honestly, I don't know. It might be that it does that to every bit of bread that you put in <laughs> <laughs> Which is really weird, uh, but it could be cool to show off to your friends as well. Uh, so, as I said, that is going to be available at the end of October. Number one on the list, though, and no doubt about this whatsoever, this is the item that inspired this video. This is also from Uncanny Brands. Also comes out in about a week's time. Uh, this will cost you $39.99. So a little more than the toaster. But totally worth it. Because it is this WWE Waffle Maker. Uh, and this definitely, definitely makes waffles in the shape of the WWE Championship center plate. So that main plate on the front of the belt doesn't matter if you're talking about the Universal uh, or WWE Championship, SmackDown Live Women's, Raw Women's. Uh, that centre plate is always the same. And uh, this will make waffles in the shape of that. Uh, how awesome is that? I really think this is cool. I really think this is cool. I don't know how great it's going to be to taste. Like, I don't know... If it's going to be a bit too thin in places because obviously it's stamping down quite a lot of the waffle to get that pattern. But still, could you imagine being greeted uh, to a plate of these every morning? That'd be awesome. Uh, so I, I'm really into this. As I said, it's not available yet. Proper tempted to put this on my own Christmas list because I don't have any kind of waffle maker. So might as well get one that makes waffles in these shapes because uh, they're awesome uh, and uh, yeah as I said this is what inspired this video so let me know your thoughts guys if you've seen anything out there that's quite weird uh, this holiday season uh, that's WWE branded then let me know uh, down in the comments below also, if you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe. We will be doing more of these kinds of videos in the coming weeks. Uh, and I think that's everything. Thanks a lot for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. And hopefully, i see you again next time. Bye for now.